CD usage have declined over the years because of the rise of digital music. We have now Spotify and other streaming media, but sometimes it's always good to use the old school way. So this is the Cambridge Audio um, CD5 or compact disc player. This is for me the best bang for the buck compact disc player that you can avail of. So let's get right, right into it. So uh, this is the again. Uh, this is the CD5. It has a um, a bigger brother, or I mean, uh, an upgrade um, uh, model, which is the CD10. Um, compared to CD10, the CD5 uh, Cambridge Audio has an RCA output only. It doesn't have uh, uh, output for uh, coaxial or uh, optical. So let's see what's inside. By the way, the box says uh, this unit does not contain cables. So it has uh, the, the plain and simple manual and and um, remote control. This is what's inside the box of the Cambridge Audio CD5. You've got the manuals and the sim, uh, slim size uh, remote control and you have the uh, some foams for your protection and the actual uh, compact disc player from Cambridge Audio. I've taken the unit out of the box and this is the uh, back panel. As I've explained earlier, the CD5 doesn't have uh, a line output for optical and coaxial so it has only an RCA output. So this is the front panel, panel of the Cambridge Audio CD5. It is uh, center loading. You've got here the uh, front buttons, the power on and off, the eject button. You've got the play and pause, stop, and uh, skip buttons. So again, this is the uh, Cambridge Audio Topaz CD5. Uh, this is a best uh, bang for the buck uh, compact disc. Player. So this is the miniature uh, remote control of the uh, Topaz CD5. It has a uh, CR2025 uh, battery and you've got the uh, normal buttons for a compact disc player. 